Hi everyone, welcome to Imaging Study. Today we are going to see a case of Peyronie disease. This is a very common case in our routine practice, but most of the patients hesitate visiting doctors. A 42-year-old male patient came with painful erection and abnormal penile curvature. Let's see what we have got on ultrasound. Here you can see the transverse section of the penile shaft. These are the corpora cavernosa and this is the corpora spongiosum and the surrounding layer is tunica albuginea. You see an ecogenic area casting posteroacoustic shadows seen in the tunica albuginea between two corpora cavernosa. This ecogenic structure is nothing but a calcified plaque. If you check carefully, you can find other calcified plaques also. During erection, due to stretching, these plaques will create pain and suddenly the erection process will get stopped. They also will contribute making an abnormal curvature. These calcified areas have no communication with the cavernosal arteries. You see these are the cavernosal arteries with ecogenic walls. Here is the picture of the penile shaft with two calcified plaques. This is the right one, it is a large plaque and this is the smaller one which lies in between two corpora cavernosa. The larger one is situated at the dorsal aspect. Here again the picture of the plaques and the picture of the calcified structures. The smaller one is quite well visualized here. The approximate measurements shows 5 and 2.5 mm size of these plaques. Here is the lung section of the right and left corpora cavernosa showing normal ecotexture with no definite hematoma or any other abnormality. So in summary, ecogenic calcified plaques are noted within the tunica alvogenia between two corpora cavernosa casting acoustic shadows without any vascular involvement. These features conclude it as a case of Peyronie disease. Now the take home message. Neurovascular involvement is very common in Peyronie disease. So don't forget to check the vessels around. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to subscribe our YouTube channel and try to follow us on other social platforms. Don't forget to visit imagingstudy.com for more cases. See you on the next one. Have a nice day.